Welcome back with a new math lesson. Our lesson today about the Cartesian product. In this lesson, we will know how to find the product of two sets. At the first, we have to start with the ordered pair. The ordered pair represented by two numbers inside the brackets, and this ordered pair represented on the coordinate plane. We can say the point three and five, and it's represented by three units on x-axis and five units on y-axis. Then that's the coordinate of the point three and five. Let three and five equals a. Then this point is called a. At the point three and five, three is called the first projection. And five is called the second projection. We have to know that three and five is not equals to five and three, because in three and five, as we said before, move three units to the right and five units up. But five and three, you have to move five units in x-axis. And three units on y-axis. Then let the point five and three equals p. That means the point A is not equal to the point B. There is a difference between the point three and five, which is not equal to the set of three and five, which is not equal to the set of interval three and five. The first mean the ordered pair. And it's represented on the coordinate plane. I need just one point. For the set of three and five, I need the number three and number five. Then it will be set of three and five. And I need two points on the number line. For the third one, it's called interval, and we have to start from three to four. For any two ordered pairs, if a and b equals x and y, that means a equals x and b equals y. By the same, we can solve. For the first ordered pair, x minus two and three. The second, five and y plus one. As we know that the first projection equals the first projection, the second projection equals the second projection. Then we can say x minus two equals five. X minus two equals five, and y plus one equals three. Y plus one equals three. To find x, we have to solve for x. Then x equals five plus two. Then x equals seven. To find the value of y, we have to solve for y. Then y equals three minus one. Then y equals two. Find a and b in each of the following. As you know that the first projection equals the first projection. And the second equals the second, then a equals negative five, and b equals nine. For the second one, a minus two equals two, and b plus one equals negative three. B plus one equals negative three. By solving for a, then a equals two plus two, then a equals four. By solving for b, then b equals negative three minus one, then b equals negative four. By the same. The first equal the first, and the second equal the second. Then two minus a equals six. Two minus a equals six, 
and b minus 3 equals negative 1 b minus 3 equals negative 1 by solving for a the negative a equals 6 minus 2 the negative a equals 4 that's mean a equals negative 4 by solving for b then b equals negative 1 plus 3 then b equals 2 by the same the first equals the first then a minus 7 equals negative 2 and the second equals the second then b bar 3 minus 1 equals 26 by solving for a then a equals negative 2 plus 7 then a equals 5 by solving for b then b bar 3 equals 26 plus 1 then b bar 3 equals 27 then b equals the cubic root of 27 then b equals 3 how to find the product of two sets to find x product y or y product x if I say x product y I have to start with each element of x connected with each element of y for this example we can say if x equals a and b y equals negative 1 0 and 3 then I need to find x product y to find x product y then I have to start to connect each element of x with element of y then it will be a and negative 1 a and 0 a and 3 b and negative 1 b and 0 b and 3 To find the second product, y product x, we have to start from y. The negative 1 and a, negative 1 and b. Negative 1 and a, negative 1 and b. 0 and a, 0 and b. 0 and a, 0 and b. 3 and A, 3 and B. 3 and A, 3 and B. From the solution we find that A and negative 1, negative 1 and A. A and 0, 0 and A. That means the first ordered pair is A and B and the second ordered pair is B and A. Then we can say that A and B equals B and A then x product y is not equals y product x as we know that's union defined by this sign and it's mean all element of the two sets but for the second operation intersection which is defined by this sign I need just the common element the common element but for the third operation it's called difference which is defined by this sign I need the element which belongs to the first and not belongs to the second the element which belongs to the first set and not belongs to the second set
we can start with another example if x equals 1 y equals 2 and 3 z equals 2 5 and 6 represent x y and z by using the Venn diagram then find each of the following at the first to represent by using the Venn diagram we have to find the common element there is a common element between y and z 2 and 2 then write 2 at the middle between y and z the remainder at y is 3 and the remainder at z 5 and 6 then we can write the set of x which equals 1 to find the x product y we have to start from x to y then the first ordered pair will be 1 and 2 1 and 3 1 and 2 1 and 3 to find y product z you have to start from y to z then 2 and 2 2 and 5 2 and 6 2 and 2 2 and 5 2 and 6 by the same 3 and 2 3 and 5 3 and 6 3 and 2 3 and 5 3 and 6 we can continue by using the same Venn diagram to find x product z then we have to start from x to z then it will be 1 and 2 1 and 5 1 and 6 then the ordered pair will be 1 and 2 1 and 5 1 and 6 if I need y squared that's mean y product y by an easy way we can write the same element of the set of y then it will be 2 and 2 2 and 3 3 and 2 3 and 3 then the first order pair will be 2 and 2 2 and 3 3 and 2 3 and 3 the second find the x product y union y product z as we know that union I need all of the element without repeating then as the first we have to find x product y as we said before x product y is 1 and 2 1 and 3 1 and 2 1 and 3 then find y product z which is 2 and 2 2 and 5 2 and 6 3 and 2 3 and 5 3 and 6 2 and 2 2 and 5 2 and 6 3 and 2 3 and 5 3 and 6 then to find x product y union y product z you have to write all of the elements then it will be 1 and 2 1 and 3 1 and 2 1 and 3 but don't repeat any element then it 2 and 2 2 and 5 2 and 6 3 and 2 3 and 5 3 and 6 by using the same Venn diagram I need X product Y intersection Z at the first we have to write the set of X which equals 1 then write Y intersection Z Y intersection Z equals 2 the set of 2 then to find 
x product y intersection z then it will be the ordered pair of 1 and 2 by the same way I need x product y intersection x product z at the first we have to find x product y by the same way 1 and 2 1 and 3 then find x product z which is 1 and 2 1 and 5 1 and 6 as you know that the intersection I need just the common element then the common element 1 and 2 1 and 2 then to write x product y intersection x product z the result will be the set of the ordered pair 1 and 2 by using the same Venn diagram find z different y product x union y at the first we have to find z different y as we said before different that means I need the element which belongs to the first and not belongs to the second then z different y is 5 and 6 then find x union y then I need all element of x and y which is 1 2 and 3 then 1 2 and 3 after that I need z different x product x union y then it will be we will start from z different x 5 and 1 5 and 2 5 and 3 6 and 1 6 and 2 6 and 3 5 and 1 5 and 2 5 and 3 6 and 1 6 and 2 6 and 3 if x equals 2 and negative 1 y equals 4 and 0 z equals 4 5 and negative 2 find x product y as we said before x product y we have to start from x then it will be 2 and 4 2 and 0 negative 1 and 4 negative 1 and 0 then 2 and 4 2 and 0 negative 1 and 4 negative 1 and 0 the second one I need y product z then starting from y 4 and 4 4 and 5 4 and negative 2 0 and 4 0 and 5 0 and negative 2 4 and 4 4 and 5 4 and negative 2 0 and 4 0 and 5 0 and negative 2 I need x square that means x product x can write 2 and negative 1 then it will be 2 and 2 2 and negative 1 negative 1 and 2 negative 1 and negative 1 then it will be 2 and 2 2 and negative 1 negative 1 and 2 negative 1 and negative 1 n of x product z what is the meaning of n of the product of x and z that means the number of elements after product x and z to find n of the product of x and z at the first we have to find the number of x the number of element of x equals 2 2 and negative 1 which is 2 element n of z which is 3 element then n 
of the product of x and z equals 2 multiplied by 3 which equals 6 by the same way we can find n of y square then n of y equals 2 that's mean n of y square equals 4 n of z square by the same way n of z equals 1 2 3 then it will be 3 then n of z square equals 3 square equals 9 if x equals 1 and 2 y equals 3 4 and 5 find x product y and represent it by arrow diagram then by Cartesian diagram as we said before to find x product y we can start from x to y then it will be 1 and 3 1 and 4 1 and 5 2 and 3 2 and 4 2 and 5 1 and 3 1 and 4 1 and 5 2 and 3 2 and 4 2 and 5 to represent by arrow diagram, if you want to find x product y, then you have to write x at the first and y at the second. But if you want to find y product x, then write a y at the first and x at the second. Just write the element 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. Put the point. Draw the arrow from 1 to 3, from 1 to 4, from 1 to 5, then from 2 to 3, from 2 to 4, from 2 to 5. By the same way, if you want to find the Cartesian product, x product y, then write x down and y up. But if you want to find y product x, then write y and x. Write the numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Put the point. That's the first point. Second. One and three. One and four. One and five. Two and three. 2 and 4, 2 and 5. If x equals 3, 4 and 8, find x product x, then represent by arrow diagram. As we said before, by an easy way, we can write 3, 4, 8, then x product x, it will be 3 and 3, 3 and 4, 3 and 8, 3 and 3, 3 and 4 3 and 8 4 and 3 4 and 4 4 and 8 4 and 3 4 and 4 4 and 8 8 and 3 8 and 4 8 and 8 8 and 3 8 and 4 8 and 8 to represent by arrow diagram this relation from x to x that's the set of x 3 4 and 8 The first order to be 3 and 3, then write 3 and 3, 3 and 4, 3 and 8. The second, 4 and 3, 4 and 4, 4 and 8. 8 and 3, 8 and 4, 8 and 8. 